Hello and welcome to Beyond Wings, the aviation and travel show and I'm your host Sumit Chaturvedi. At places of worship, devotees pray and wish for many things. Progress, health, wealth, prosperity and what not. But have you heard about a place of worship specifically meant to fulfill prayers for travel documents? Here's a report by our correspondent Siddharth MP from one such temple in the southern Indian city of Chennai. It's a busy weekday in Chennai city. Office goers are headed for work, business hours have begun. The arterial roads are choked with traffic. But that's not so in some of the smaller bylanes of the city. We're here in a small lane closer to the airport of the city. And here you can see a good crowd of young and old gathered in front of a temple. Let's see what's so interesting about this place. Sri Lakshmi Visa Ganapati Temple. Isn't that a unique name? In India, Goddess Lakshmi denotes wealth and prosperity. Lord Ganapati denotes wisdom and is regarded as the remover of obstacles. But where did the visa in the temple's name come from? It refers to the travel document that one requires when entering a foreign country. Isn't a visa something that is issued by a foreign consulate or an embassy? What role does a temple play? The temple was constructed in 1998 by your grandfather. The main reason for constructing the temple is the since house is situated in three corners of the roadside uh, to overcome the vastu defect. Okay, a uh, lot of nearby peoples like housewives, students, a lot of street vendors and other businessmen used to come and pray regularly, and they all well settled and well flourished after praying here. God blesses with what they uh, pray. As the temple priest begins the daily ritual, more devotees begin to gather. It's a daily tradition to beat the idol. Milk, curd, turmeric, tender coconut water. The deity is bathed in all these offerings and finally decorated. As part of the ritual, the devotees also offer copies of their passports. I am coming from Coimbatore, it's nearly around 400-450 kilometers from here and uh, we just visited the temple last year, uh, a year ago. Uh, by then my visa was in process, so many people around and even on internet, uh, this temple was making a lot of buzz right after the pandemic and uh, we just want to give a go. Nestled in a small by lane, the temple is in one of those huge ancient monuments. It's the exact opposite. It's as small as a temple could get. However, don't go by the looks. There are many who believe that praying here has made a difference and helped them get their visa. Work visa, visa interview appointment, H1B, all these are among the prayers that devotees come with. While the temple is not very famous among the local residents, those who are in need of a visa for sure know about the place. Word of mouth, social media and instant messaging and the faith of the believers has taken the deity's fame far and wide. This is our maiden visit to the Sri Lakshmi Visa Ganapati Temple in Chennai. The devotees and believers we met here tell us that be it troubles in getting visas or be it troubles getting appointment for the visa interviews, they came here and they prayed or their relatives prayed here on their behalf and whatever they wanted was absolutely fulfilled. That's the tradition of this temple here in Chennai and that's why devotees and believers from far and wide as far as nearby towns and cities and even different states are coming here to get their wishes for a visa fulfilled. We on now available in your country. Download the app and get all the news on the move.